The Kilauean volcano has now made vicious eruption a natural part of Hawaii's Big Island landscape as established lava channels from the volcano begin to overflow in dramatic scenes. Hawaii's Big Island remains under the grip of the Kilauea volcano, sending a constant stream of lava from its summit and fissures towards the ocean. So far, more than 600 properties have been destroyed in the wake of the disaster and thousands of people have been left staying with relatives or in emergency shelters. No one has been killed, unlike the recent Guatemala volcano which killed more than 100 people while almost 200 remain missing. The established channel from the Kilauea towards the ocean is now said to be overflowing, producing a fresh lava threat for properties. The Hawaiian Volcano Observatory said the volcano remains very much active, still spewing lava from Fissures 8 and 18. Fissure 8 has been adding lava to the channel, resulting in small and short-lived overflows. As of this morning, no further overflows were being observed and the main flow has now crusted over. But fresh lava is still oozing from the Kapoho Bay coast, although it is now moving under this crust. As a result of the overflows in progress of lava towards more homes, the public have been restricted from accessing part of the Kapoho Bay area. The Hawaii Civil Defense Authority advises that gas emissions in lays coming from the ocean entry is still high. In addition, Smaller earthquakes and seismic activity in the area has the authority asking people to monitor utility connections of gas, electricity, and water. Many zones in the national park and around homes have now been declared uninhabitable and will likely not be occupied again for years to come. Although natural environments can regenerate fully following eruption, it is expected that this will take a long time. Hawaii Volcanoes National Park Acting Superintendent Rondolo is so far unsure about how soon it will be before the park is reopened. Talking to the Honolulu Star Advertiser she said, We're really waiting to hear from the scientists from the about when conditions have changed to the point that we can look at. It's a huge unknown. The recent eruption has apparently occurred in highly visited areas of the park, so a large amount of revenue will probably be forfeited. Kilauea has been busy, having spilt more than 25 million cubic meters of lava already, enough to fill an Olympic swimming pool every 25 seconds. Big Island is Hawaii's largest, and lava now covers 61,000 of it. At 2,577,920 acres total, this means that 4.2% of the whole island is now covered in streaming lava. The outcrop of land created as a result of the eruption currently juts out into the ocean by almost one mile.